Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how to draw Baby Dory. So let's get started. Okay, so the first thing that we're going to start by doing is drawing two little hills for the top of her head. So the, she is rather small, so you want to try and make these um, smaller scale, but if you're doing a larger drawing, then feel free to make them a little bit bigger to fit the scale. So now we're going to be drawing her giant eyes. Now she has circular, big, big circular eyes, so if you are not as comfortable with circles, you are welcome to trace these. Okay, and you want them rather close to each other, just like this. So it will look something like this, so that we have two circles side by side. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is start by drawing her iris, just like this. Again, like another circle, and then her little pupil. Not really little, it's, it's rather large. And don't forget to add in that little highlight. Okay, and do the exact same thing on this side. Add in the iris. And this one is going to be kind of coming toward the eyeball a little bit more instead of like... It's not as centered. It's, not, it's a little off-centered. Okay, so now what we're going to do is draw her little body. Just like this. And this is a U-shape, so um, it's, it's super simple. Okay, and so here is our shape so far. Now we're going to draw her mouth. Again, another little U. And you kind of want it to be rather rounded. And it's, it's really small, so try and make it as round as possible. Then we're going to draw her little fin over there. And then we're going to draw this one over here. So here is our basic shape of Dory. And now we're going to add on to it by drawing her back fin. This one can be kind of tricky, so try as best you can to follow along with what I'm showing. And then what I did was just split the fins into three sections, and we're gonna have three different colors in our fins, but on the back fin, we'll just have two. Okay, so once I'm done with my line art, I'm just going to go back in and add any lines that I forgot to add um, when I'm doing the line art. So now I'm just going to take my kneaded eraser to erase all of the pencil lines. If you guys do not have a kneaded eraser, totally fine. You can use just a block eraser. Works just as well. Okay, so now we're just going to be adding in our colors. I'm using Ohuhu markers, but you guys can use whatever. You can even use colored pencils, you can use crayons if you want, uh, doesn't matter. So I will have the colors I used pop up in the lower left hand corner for you guys if you want to know what colors I used. So this was pretty simple, um, coloring wise I just pre did, I mean, a pretty flat coloring. <laughs> Super simple. Okay, so here I'm just coloring in her eyes. Now this is going to be using a technique with your markers called blending. I'm sure you've heard of it. It's really, really simple. So I just took one dark color on top of the eye and then a lighter color on top. And while the ink was still a little wet, I pretty much blended <laughs> the two colors together in the middle. I hope that makes sense. But it's, it's pretty simple. Okay, so after I added all of my black, I'm gonna go in with my yellow, and this is for the tips of her fins, 
and all of that so I am actually going to go back with my black here and fix that I forgot to color that part in yeah <laughs> so after that what I'm going to do is grab another color and color in her tongue and all of that just kind of fixing up that little fin and then it's time for her tongue now it is anyway <laughs> So yeah, that is pretty much it, I think. Oh, yeah, forgot. Gotta add in that little highlight. Just And the paper is white, but still add a little bit more of a highlight, I guess, <laughs> for that. And don't forget to sign your drawing to just personalize it and let everyone know that you drew it. All right, so here is our completed drawing of Baby Dory. I do think she turned out really, really cute, and she is such a simple drawing to do. Now, you guys can do this in many different ways. Um, I also did it in my Tantone sketchbook, which I really liked, so here it is here, and I did it with colored pencils. Um, not the best of colored pencils, but I do think it turned out really cute, and I really liked the different style, but I do think I liked the white paper version better. So that is it for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, please hit that like button, and don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you Thursday. Bye!